Hey guys, it is Josh here from Absolute Snow and I'm bringing you this beautiful Nidecker Mosquito for winter 2021. This board is from their Snow Surf Quiver range and is designed to be ridden like a surfboard on the snow. This is your all mountain free ride board that can be downsized to make sure you have a pocket full of fun wherever you're riding. If you're carving it up on the piece or going deep in the backcountry, take one of these with you and you will have fun, I guarantee it. So as you can see, this board is a full directional board. It's got a big wide nose on it and then a nice fish tail on the back. That tail is gonna to wanna to sink in the powder and the nose is gonna to wanna to float. So in that deep stuff, really nice. What they've done is they've stiffened out the tail of this board, meaning that when you're carving, you're gonna have the ultimate grip at the end of the carve, giving you power throughout the turn. The profile of the board is a camrock profile. So it is cambered to the tail, all the way to the front of your bindings, and then rockers up. That camber is where you're gonna get the aggression from when you're carving. So edge to edge is gonna be really quick, especially with this really nice tight side cut and tapered tail. Um, but the nose of the board with that rocket section, again, gonna give you the float. This board is slightly stiffer, as I say on that tail is stiff, but as a whole, it's a stiff board as well. It's about a seven to eight on the flex rating, just again, kind of adding to the power of the snowboard. This really is a powerful snowboard, whether you're riding fast charging the hill or deep in the powder. And as I said before, this board should be ridden downsized. So I would normally ride around a 155. I'm about 80 kilos and about five foot 11. On this, I would probably ride it at about a 148. So about seven centimeters shorter than the usual board. This is just due to the contact points still there, meaning that you're gonna have still the same feel when you're riding. But when you get into them trees and you want quick turns to get through them tight uh, corners, this board will be able to do it by downsizing and going a little bit shorter. So true to the inspiration of this board, it has a very surf feel look to it. What they use is the night active construction method. This is where the board has got a curved edges. The curved edges not only look great, but they also give the ultimate pressure to the edge of the snowboard. Again, giving you power in that carve. In line with that, what they've done is they've added the light core. Now the light gives it away. This board is super light underfoot. They use three types of wood that work in perfect harmony to make sure that you have a really durable, responsive snowboard, but again, light underfoot. And making sure that you're not gonna be left behind in the hot snow, what they've done is added the N9000 sintered base. This is Nidecker's most premium base. It absorbs loads of wax glides like nothing else and is very durable underfoot. So you'll find if you hit it on a rock, you shouldn't be going to the services with a core shot. So this board is truly inspired to surf the snow. Just like a surfboard, it comes with a nice little surf sleeve just to keep it safe. But it really is designed so that you can run quick and fast in the turn if you're carving up the slush, the powder or the piece, no matter where you are. If you're a beginner, probably say clear of this board, it is quite a uh, aggressive board for you and you might not be so forgiving, but if you're an intermediate to expert who wants a board that's gonna be fun in the quiver for them powder days or them slushy or uh, just cruisy days on the hill where you really wanna put the board to the max, this is definitely one to check out. This is a Nidecker Mosquito for winter 2021.